Hi YouTubers, this is Phoenix251080. I'm here to do a quick update on my recent purchases of my Blu-ray Steelbooks. Um, these have been purchased over the last few weeks and I thought I'd do it now before I get too many and I'll make the video too long. So first of all I'll start off with the Godfather trilogy steelbook this is the play.com exclusive as you can see very plain but very nice sort of uh, matte finish uh, the title is uh, embossed and there's just a J card there so here you got the spine very simple and this is the back but this is obviously a J card so but it has a plain back so overall for this tool book for classic film very plain but uh, I think it makes up with the embossing on there well, next you guys will also know that play.com also released Shutter Island I haven't watched this film yet, but I've heard mixed reviews. Uh, so, guys, you can leave me some comments. Let me know what this film's. How would you rate this film? Is it good? So, that's the spine. And again, you've got the J card in the back. Next we have Forrest Gump, awesome film, this is a classic, I wanted to get the German version but I waited out for it and it came out so I'm happy Play.com released a UK release, very white matte finish and it's got an awesome picture of Forrest Gump. Tom Hanks sitting on the bench. And there you got the spine, very simple. And you got the J card back. So that's Forrest Gump. Next we have The Raid. Now, this is an awesome film. It's got one of the best embossings and debossing that I've seen in a still book. Uh, as you can see for the windows, you can see that the windows itself has the debossing. And then you got the title as well. This has sold out on play.com and it's going for city prices on eBay. But if you're lucky, one of the lucky ones who got this on pre-order, uh, you'll f find that once you open it, you enjoy the still book as well as the film. It's got tons of action in it, and very, very enjoyable. So there you got the raid, and that's the back. Now the back has got a picture of the tower block. Again, it's got debossing at the back as well, around the windows. So it's got some beautiful artwork inside as well. Next, we have Cabin in the Woods. This is a very uh, unique uh, still book, but uh, the reason why it's unique, like everybody who pre ordered the Cabin in the Woods, the CD inside is most likely a defective CD, so everybody's going to release, uh, get a copy of uh, the Blu-ray sent to them from HMV. Um, but this is an awesome looking still book, and very shiny finish, and this is a picture of the cabin. Uh, obviously the cabins are not actually like this in the film, but as you, if you watch the film itself, it has a, a 
very interesting twist that I haven't really seen in a horror film before so it's very interesting and I quite enjoyed this film as well so there you got the spine and you got the back which is just the J card itself so I'm quite happy with the quality that comes in so that's Cabin in the Woods and lastly, I thought I saved the best for last, is The Avengers Assemble. This is an awesome film. Uh, for the still book itself, I'm quite disappointed. Um, the design is pretty standard throughout the whole world, uh, with slight differences. So, like other other ones... Uh, this one has a bit of a uh, embossing and everything in there. You got debossing borders, and it's a single disc uh, from HMV, and for the price it came at, I think it's pretty much worth it for a single disc. But I wish uh, HMV or maybe another company went out and done a beautiful package for this. If you see in America, Canada, uh, even Germany, they have a good edition, a steelbook edition, as well as a gift box set for this film. This is an awesome film, but you know I've got this, got this part of my collection, and I'm expecting the Canadian version to me, which is the three D four uh four disc box uh the four disc set. So that's the Avengers Assemble. So that's all my still books that I've got in the last few weeks. I'm hoping to do some more still book reviews. And I'm hoping to do them much sooner than I did uh, these ones. This is my last video. So thanks guys for watching. Please leave some comments. Let me know what Shot Island's like if it's a good film or not um, tell me what still books are you waiting for did you order any of these uh, so please subscribe to my channel up there uh, leave some comments and I hope to see you next week uh, when I've got tons of more still books coming out this month uh, which are all awesome films classic films that I have to order so take care guys and I hope to see you soon Take care.